Hello and welcome to all Magento users. This is your friend Chaitan Chauhan. We have taken the task to help you out and teach you some basic tips and tricks for Magento backend. So in this first video, you will learn about Magento that is dashboard. Before we start, if you are new to our channel, then click the subscribe button. And after watching this video, if you feel that it was useful for you, then do not forget to like and share. Without wasting any time, let's get started. Okay, so we are now onto the dashboard of Magento admin. Now this is the dashboard of Magento. Uh, this is the front side or the website where your customers will be visiting on your website. Now this is the back end. Now let us go one by one. Few important options of dashboard. Here you see the scope where you see all the stores now please remember that magento allows to manage multiple stores from a single admin that means from this admin only you can manage multiple stores so if you click down all the stores that you have created using this admin then that will be displayed over here from on the right hand side you have admin click on the drop down you will see the customer view click on the customer view and you will be redirected to the front side or the website just log in into here on the admin and you want to go to the front store just click on this option now if you go and scroll down you will display the best seller products right now you won't find anything as this as website is totally new from here you can view the most view products which your customers are viewing on your website here you can see the new customers the old customers or all customers list will be displayed when you click on here right this this way now if you click on new customers it will display the new customers right now there is only one customer okay now on the left hand side we have a bar where we have all the different options now let us go important options one by one so if you click on sale here the the very useful option is orders if you click on here the orders how much orders you have received today till now will be displayed in this manner so all these options we will be dis discussing in another video now let us go on to the second uh, option that is category here there are two options only that is product and category if you click on product it will display all the list of products that you have created on your website and if you go back and click on category it will display the categories so here you can create a new subcategory as well as you can create a new category over here alone let me go onto the front store and show you what i mean by category here this is the root category and this is the subcategory now you can see woman is the root category and if you click on this plus sign you see this is subcategory tops and bottoms now on the front store it is created in this way now these are the products in tops category and these are the products these two are the products in bottoms category same way man is the root category and tops and bottoms are the subcategories and inside those these are the products let's go back and uh, look at another menu and there is customers all the list of customers will be displayed over here when you click on this one see other option which is very important for you to know on the dashboard is reports you can generate different kinds of report related to marketing sales customers product customer engagement and so on and so forth now here if you go on to the stores you can create uh, currency rates according to that country so you can set those from here if you go and scroll down you will have this system here a very important point is user roles you can create different roles and can delegate your work to your subordinates or to your employees or you can assign some virtual assistant if you need be to manage your website where you can create different user roles so you can create different roles from here so this was the basic overview of the dashboard when you click on this option dashboard you will be landing onto the dashboard again hope you have enjoyed this video and see you in the next video pretty soon thanks for watching